Hey, welcome to Cinemondo. I'm Kathy, and I am here to talk about, you know, a Bengali film. We have not done a ton of Bengali films. You don't see them that often, so I'm always really excited when I see it. I've gotten some requests saying, please review this teaser for a Bengali film, and it's called Kadan. Now, very interesting. Anytime I see something that involves an axe, I'm there. Just That's all you have to say. If you're going to say, hey, you need to review this movie, just say, and there's an axe in it, then I'll get to it faster. So... <laughs> But this is a teaser for the movie Kadan. It is a new Bengali film. It's directed by Dudit Sojit, and it stars Death. So this movie comes out in December, I think December 20th. This is a teaser. There's more to come, which is always good if it's involving axes, as I've said. So I definitely want to take a look at this. Be sure to subscribe, like, and comment. Love hearing from you guys. Love to hear your comments and your suggestions. Always up for it. So be sure to let me know. Okay, let's take a look. And I'm very excited. Here we go. Okay. to Oh, the bell bottom. Bring it up. Yeah. Accent Oh. 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 Oh, a dance scene. Oh, no. Oh, okay then. Aji Jumin. Kadan Hobbik. Nice. <laughs> Not to wow. Sosan. <laughs> Evil laugh at the end. Oh my god. Okay. They have some great action stuff in that. You know, there's something about accidents are just so nasty. There's just oh god, they're just gross. Okay. Which is why I love them. This looked like a really great entry into the action film arena. I love that Bengali's bringing on the action. He looked great in it. How do people do that cigarette thing where you kind of turn it in? Doesn't that hurt? He looked great in this. I love it. He looked really cool. You know, we have the great cigarette light. We have all the great tropes. We have the great flying through the air. We have the lighting the cigarette with something overkill, basically. We have a lot of big explosions. And this big open kind of crazy, you know, landscapes that they're shooting in and make it look very epic. And I love the desat tones in it. And, you know, this is, this looks like a great teaser. Not a ton of information yet. Looks like some friends getting into trouble. Don't ride your motorcycle toward a train. I don't think that's a good idea. But overall, this looked like a really fun movie. I am very, very much into seeing this. And also we have some posters. You know, I love talking about posters. I don't know if you guys know, I do posters for a living. So I'm really into movie poster design. This is a great shot. I love the high angle. You see the real, you know, the victim in the background kind of looks like he's been dragged a little bit or maybe he flew and then died as he hit the ground, kind of slid. I love that they have the title kind of interacting in the environment where he's standing on it. That's, that's You don't realize how hard that is to get people to agree to do that because the titles look comes a little hard to read and then nobody wants to uh, you know, have a poster out where you can't read the title. It's, it's common when it comes to clients, but he has two axes here. One is a very fancy one. Very fancy axe on this one. Now, next. This is like, he's just kicking back right now. This almost looks like a behind the scenes shot, like where he's hanging out waiting to start a scene, which it could be. It could be, a, you know, hey, I'm going to be shooting soon. Uda, I love to have a design by Riju. Good job, guy. You know, you don't get credit. Movie poster designers do not get credit. They just don't. So another another cool idea where you get the type in the background kind of interacting with the talent. Looks like you know, he's kind of overlapping it a little bit. It's a little bit easier to read this time, but you see like that crazy landscape, you know, the industrialized kind of like quarry or something. Then we have the classic yak pose and we have that fancy yak. And so we have some victims back there. One of them looks like almost like a woman. I'm not sure. It's hard to tell. They're body parts, you guys. Uh, it's just body parts. But I like that they have the uh, birds flying around. Maybe vultures, unless there's another bird that would symbolize something more badass. But vultures are not a good sign when there's blood and death. So that's sort of also an indicator that he has done his job here. <laughs> so we also have the power lines or, you know, kind of the, the gives it a little more industrialized feel besides, you know, the crazy architecture in the background and Again, really nice job. Nice one. They look a little stripped in, but that's okay. It's okay. They were definitely not part of this background originally, but it looks really cool. And they got both of them in this one. So 
they're friends. It's it's a story about friendship. Be sure and let me know what you think of this teaser. I'm looking forward to seeing the full trailer. This was just a little taste. And in that little taste, we saw a lot of great action tropes. And I would like to see more of those. So anyway, let me know what you think. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.